you not see at night? Today we're gonna figure out how to fix that. For this repair we're gonna need masking tape, a variety of sandpaper, some polish, and a polishing rag and clear coat. Right, so we're gonna we're gonna fill this bucket with water for the wet sanding. Next, we gotta go to the mailbox and get the weekly paper so we can mask. Let's go for a journey down the driveway. Oh no, Tom's running. Oh, good. Good. <laughs> so you start with your uh, lowest grit paper and move up consecutively numerically until you get to your highest obviously the goal is just to get rid of all the hazing you're removing a UV protecting coating that's why we're going to clear after though because when you sand it there's a coating from the factory and a lot of this oxidizing is because of that coating broach breaking down so what we're sanding here is we're not actually sanding the plastic of the headlight quite yet like we'll sand into a bit of it Yeah, it's like hot. Adrian said, normally you go from like 40 or 60 to something like 120, maybe 300, but we only have 600 grit. So, so we go hard with the 600. Well, like honestly, we're going from 40 grit to 600 grit to 1500. 1500 is like good, like you would wet sand a car, like the paint you, you with that. You want to get it to at least a 600 grit finish before you uh, clear coat. Thousand even. But yeah, 1000 or 15 is preferable. Maybe even 2000 if you're really fancy. Taking the clear. God, I got it nice and mixed. All right, we're going to clear. Thin coat to start with. Get her a little wet. Get her a little wet, but don't finish. Not yet. You finish this soon, you put on too much. We're going in for round two. Uh, that's looking pretty fucking nice. My God, the clearness. Is that not nice, man? That's pretty fucking nice. I honestly, at the very base, I'd go back to the fourth. Oh, it's all wet. Nice. That means we did it right. <laughs> Don't let the masking touch the, the fresh stuff on the lens. Toss out your garbage like a responsible citizen. <laughs> 